It says go live. Well, you think? No, I thought I'd go dead. No, I thought I'd go comatose. No, I'm going live. This is the Ted Nugent Spirit Campfire. I figured, and what I would do. Rise and shine, live life to the fullest, be samurai, make every day a martial arts gonzo day. Well, that's what I'm doing right here. It's called the Ted Nugent Spirit Campfire. And once again, I will reiterate because repetition will solidify truth, logic, and common sense. But you got to repeat truth, logic, common sense because it is common and sensible in the hearts, minds, bodies, souls, and spirits of thoughtful, conscientious critical thinking Americans. If you're not a critical thinker, bah, bah. critical thinking. Welcome to the Ted Nugent Spirit Campfire, where it's just a tsunami, a bombardment, an A-10, an A-10 warthog attack of positive energy, spirit, and goodwill and decency. And you know that. So thank you for sharing the Ted Nugent Spirit Campfire with me. But I typically only do it on Mondays. Sometimes I sneak in an addendum, an auxiliary Ted Nugent Spirit Campfire. But I want to thank everybody out there, number one, for being shit kickers. Thank you. Only the shit kickers I'm thanking. I'm thanking you for being shit kickers, for standing up for the most important American pulse heartbeat of them all. Defiance. Thought out, critical thinking, defiance. I salute you and love you all. That's what makes shit kicker America unlike France. And I have a lot of friends in France. In fact, people from France come over to see the Ted News Rock and Roll Tour because you can't do this in France. 
You're not allowed to think like me in France. You can't come up with guitar riffs like me in France. You're never going to come up with grinding. Anyhow, I get carried away. But you know, the American dream is about getting carried away. Don't settle for the status quo. If it's written in stone, blow up the stone. So thank you, my shit kicker American blood brothers of spirit, attitude, and uh, piss and vinegar tsunami. -ian. I'm here mostly because I just got in from a deer hunt and I was skunked. I saw two little booger bucks, some what I call butterball bucks, and Shemaine went to the best spot on the property. They didn't see Jack squat. She saw a black cat. I'm going to get that black cat, I promise you. I'm already getting ready with my live traps and some gooey cat bait. I will eliminate the uh, ground nesting slaughter pig cat from Spirit Wild Ranch. So welcome to the Ted Nugent Spirit Campfire. The most important thing I got to say to you now is Ted Nugent, greasy speakeasy, rock and roll, firestorm, Saturday, December 4, in Waco, Texas at Tucker Hall, Highway 6. Let me make sure everybody gets that. And I know a lot of you can't come. I got friends from Germany on here and in France. I love my French shit kickers because in the heart and soul of all men is a defiant, independent, self-sufficient, rugged individual shit kicker. And I happen to have perfected the soundtrack for rugged individual, defiant, self-sufficient, hardworking shit kicker Americans, no matter where you're from. <laughs> so, so with John Kutz on drums, just an animal. John, I love you, buddy. Johnny Big on bass guitar. Holy shit. You know, I got Greg Smith and Jason Hartless. By the way, thank you for all the positive feedback, Grindfire, for the lovely love song, Come and Take It. Have you seen the lyric video? Is that just precious? You know, I didn't invent precious, but I have perfected it with the American shit kicker love song to the government. Barack, come and take it. Um, so thank you for the feedback on that. There's some adequate Birdland feedback on the song. But we have a brand new record, Ted Nugent, Detroit Muscle, which won't be out till next spring. I don't know how that works. But come and take it, a, a an animal breeding dance song of love to the government. Um, is out now. Come and take it. Thank you for your positive gargantuan response to that. Greg Smith, Jason Hartless, Michael Lutz, Tim and Andy Paddlin, Linda Doug, everybody, we thank you. The rest of the songs, another song, American Campfire. What a great song. What a great band. What killer musicians I've been surrounded by forever. Does God love me a lot or what? Ted Nugent Spirit Campfire here to promote that this coming Saturday, it's only two days from now, holy shit. Happy December, everybody. December 4th, two days from now, Saturday night in Waco, Texas on Highway 6, Tucker Hall. The Ted Nugent Greasy Speakeasy, old school, down and dirty, fire-breathing, primal, original rhythm and blues rock and roll. The guitar tone, holy shit. Johnny Big on bass, John Kutz on drums with Calvin Ross from Lone Star Music and Chris on the PA system. Anyhow, it's down and dirty. It's old school. It's like the church basement, 1958, which I was there. So I know the original primal scream of the most authoritative music in the world, and it will be unleashed Saturday night, this coming Saturday, December 4th. Tucker Hall, Highway 6, Waco, Texas. And I don't know how you get the tickets. I guess you got to get them at the door on Saturday, December 4th. Because it's just a family hall. It's a hall. They have bar mitzvahs and weddings and gun shows. 
The Ted Nugent Greasy Speaky is a combination of a bar mitzvah, a gun show, and a wedding, and an anniversary, and a birthday party, and Thanksgiving, Veterans Day, Independence Day, and Christmas all rolled into one. Saturday, December 4th, Tucker Hall, Highway 6, Ted Nugent Greasy Speakeasy. An absolute panic of music outrage. I promise you, it's like nothing else that is available for you anywhere on planet Earth. I promise you that. <laughs> it's a sonic bombast grind fest orgy of killer all American rhythm and blues rock and roll. So I hope to see you there. Also, there's a Ted Nugent master class, the rock and roll fantasy camp. I guess you go to rockcamp.com or you go to my website. Where do I get a hat? Ted Nugent stuff at tednugent.com. There's this dot com thing going on. It's wild. But if you want dirt bags, you probably go to dirtbag.com. But if you want shit kicker, middle finger on fire, freedom, defiance, fun, positive energy, spirit, and attitude, go to tednugent.com and sign up for a very unique. And again, I'm unique. I don't do anything like anybody else and nobody else does anything like me. Cool, huh? I guess they call that a brand. Anyhow, the Ted Nugent Masterclass Physics of Spirituality Guitar Lesson. The minutia, the grind, the spirit, the musical ejaculation that we are all capable of if we really, really get turned on adequately, properly, spiritually, and unleash it on an unsuspecting six-string instrument in your life. Ted Nugent Masterclass Guitar Get Down on, I guess it's Wednesday, Wednesday, December 7. Is that Wednesday? No, December 8th. December 8th. Yes, that's next Wednesday, a week from yesterday. So anyhow, the Masterclass, go to my website and you can sign up for that. It's outrageous. A lot of people come to the Ted Nugent Masterclass with no intention of learning any guitar just to get some of the mojo. The gonzo mojo, not just average mojo, gonzo, full tilt, beyond mojo. So that's what we do at the Ted Nugent Greasy Speakeasy on Saturday night and next Wednesday at the Ted Nugent Whackmaster class, guitar get down. So check out my website for all that kind of stuff. But thank you for that. Again, once again, we are here to celebrate that good is glowing over evil, Kyle Rittenhouse. Good is overcoming evil, Virginia. Good is overcoming rot and treason in New Jersey, truck driver over the mob. See, we can do this. <laughs> You've got to get involved. If you're not participating in this sacred experiment in self-government, the enemies of America, the America haters consider you on their team. You've got to put pressure on your mayor, your senator, your congressman, your governor, chief of police. I don't mean mean-spirited, disorderly. I mean gentlemanly-like, lady-like, firm directions to the people who work for us. That would be your mayor, your senator, your congressman, your governor, your chief of police, your state trooper commander, your sheriff. They work for we the people. A lot of them have forgot that because some of you have let them forget that. Don't let them forget that we the people have hired them. And if you really want to make a difference, I know people go, what can I do? What can I do? Welcome to the Ted Nugent Spirit Campfire. Go to HunterNation.org. Do not dismiss this. HunterNation.org. That's what you can do. That's what we did in Virginia. That's what we did in Michigan, Wisconsin, Pennsylvania in 2016. We got rid of the freaks and we hired a real statesman, a leader who secured our borders, who got energy independence, who sent NAFTA and everybody else packing down the toilet and demanded that NATO and everybody else pays their fair share and that we're not going to be part of the Paris Accord so we can pay for Bangladesh shitting in the streets. They got to pay their own environmental fines. We have the cleanest air, soil, and water on planet Earth, and that's the amount of fine we should pay. Not everybody else's, not China, not Pakistan, not India, not Bugamba. Let those, let those street shitters pay their own fines. 
when I was at the White House, the president goes, what do you think of this, Ted, this Paris Accord? And I go, burn it. We're paying fines for people who shit in the street. Are you with me? You never heard it put this succinctly, have you? That's why the Ted Nugent Spirit Campfire will roasty toasty your marshmallows of faith. <laughs> Speaking of which, thank you all for your positive response to the Ted Nugent Joe Rogan Experience podcast. I had fun. I like Joe Rogan. A lot of people go, ah, Joe Rogan's a doper and anti-gun. Joe Rogan's a good man. He's in the asset column of the American dream. We don't agree on everything, but we had a respectful dialogue. Did we not? Barack. So I support Joe Rogan. Great podcast. Great. He does. He's just, he's a force to reckon with. And he's such a muscle bound munchkin. I love this guy. Barack. And he promotes conservation and most powerful and important critical values of working hard, being in the asset column. That's what the Spirit Campfire is about. So thank you for that. And I know a lot of you come on here and go, I really get a kick out of you. Well, how do you not get a kick out of me? Come on. Oh, a lot of people said I should play Fred Bear. Okay, I'll play Fred Bear. Um, Like it happened so many times before, so many times. Yeah. The spirit of the woods is like an old good friend. Makes me feel warm and good inside And I know his name It's good to see him again Cause in the wind he's still alive Talk about Fred Bear Walk with me down the trails again You take me back Take me back where I belong, friend, friend bear. I'm glad to have you at my side, my friend. And I will join you on the big hunt before too long. It was kind of dark, another misty dusk. And it came from a tangle down below, below. And I tried, I tried to remember everything he taught me so well. I had to decide which way to go. Was I alone? Or in a hunter's tree The moment of truth Is here and now I felt his touch I felt his guiding hand I could feel it And the buck was mine Forevermore 
because of Fred Bear. I walk down these trails again. He takes me back, takes me back where I belong. Fred, Fred Bear, I'm glad to have you at my side, my friend. And I will join you on the big hunt before too long. Come on! When we're in the great outdoors, we got his spirit, we got his soul, so and he guides my steps and my arrows home. The restless spirit forever roams the Fred Bear as I walk. Down these trails again. He takes me back, takes me back where I belong. Fred, Fred Bear, I'm glad to have you at my side, my friend. And I will join you on the big hunt before too long. Curves in the wind. He's still alive. In the wind, he's still alive. Cause in the wind, I can hear, I hear Fred Bear. I hear you, Fred. 2021, baby. Let's go hunting, Fred. Come on. Hey, Fred. You go up that ridge. I'll go down in the swamp. Go get that book. Hey, Fred. George Britton is out there, Fred. Down in Florida, you know. My blood brothers. Hey, Fred. You know, if teenage, teenage thrill seekers really want to get a thrill, let them go into the Northwest and tangle with a grizzly bear, a blood, brown bear, a polar bear. They'll get a thrill that will cleanse their soul. So people wanted me to play, wanted me to play Fred Bear, so I played it for you. So welcome to uh, the Spirit Campfire, and remember, stand up for what you believe in. If you want the greatest Christmas presents, go to tednewton.com. You can get the hats. I signed another shitload of these today, and the flag. You can still get the flag. What a great Christmas present! Are you kidding me? Come and take it. 
So anyhow, thanks for sharing truth, logic, common sense, positive energy, attitude, and spirit on the Ted Nugent Spirit Campfire. And be sure to support Mike Lindell. Now, I'm always talking about this because if you really want to take care of business and sucker punch the America haters, then support those who support you like me and Mike Lindell. It's a culture war turned into a spiritual war. And Mike Lindell is fighting it like a son of a bitch. He's a great man. Rock solid in the asset column. Has great products. Go to MyPillow.com. Type in the code SPIRIT and go Christmas shopping like a maniac. And I'll probably see you here tomorrow night's Friday. I'll probably see you here because I want everybody who can possibly come to Waco next Saturday on the 4th of December to Tucker Hall on Highway 6 and see the Ted Nugent Greasy Speakeasy because it's a flame throwing riot. I hope to see you there. Live it up. Have a wonderful night. God bless real America. God bless real shit kickers. I love real shit kickers.